Gaffer at Scunthorpe this Saturday coming into the game with wins against Oldham and Newcastle's under 21s. Uh, the win the Papa John's Trophy, important win to progress into knockout stages, but also important to keep that building the winner mentality, correct? Yes, that's right. I thought everybody acquitted themselves really well, looked fresh, looked hungry. Um, the team shape was was really good, you know, and it had to be because uh, they um, they can be quite slick, you know, with the passing you know, in these academy teams. Um, but they didn't cause it too much problem, uh, too many problems, sorry, um, because we were nice and narrow in our possession, and and then um, we moved the ball about very well. But uh, it was good right from the off, you know. Obviously, scoring after six minutes helps. Lloyd Kerry was a goal scorer of that one. Eight season in a row, he's now scored for town. And Danilo also was also on the score sheet, meaning that's four goals in two games in the Papa John's Trophy. Is that really something the type of player all he is, gets the ball and just puts it in the back of the net when he gets that chance? It does. It does, because it, it, it just had a, a bit of a quieter spell in the game, just for circumstances. And um, and then there was an air of inevitability that he was going to bury that chance. And it, it's superb knowing that he is primed and ready, you know, and uh, it probably can think of himself as unlucky not to have started more games yet, but it, I know that um, he, he's ready and able um, and he's got quality, you know, um, when he's going to be called on. Focusing on Scunthorpe after last season's meeting with the Iron, are those defeats on the mind and is there a point to prove? Oh, what's on our mind is his current form, the current feeling in the place and um, ensuring the, the energy levels are really ready to have a good go on Saturday. Obviously, in the back of the mind, you know, you, you're aware that um, they beat us well and truly twice last year and um, it stays with you. You know, we want to do better than that and um, this weekend it's, we've got a chance of um, coming out of it looking a better team than we were last year. And how are Aaron Martin, Alex Patterson and Simon Power non-featured on Tuesday against Newcastle? Yeah, we're, well, we're hoping to assess them properly on the pitch tomorrow. Um, they're doing some rehab work this morning and uh, making good progress. And in recent weeks, Scunthorpe have probably struggled for results. Um, could you see us having a lot of the ball and being a tough afternoon for us? Oh, they're never, hardly ever any easy afternoons. You know, it's lead two. Um, you know, we're, we're playing, I think we're playing pretty well. You know, we, we could have played better than last week, but we found a way to win, which is great. Um, played really well on Tuesday, and we just have to keep the momentum moving forward. I mean, Scunthorpe. Um, I've got very good players, you know, um, we've got Colescore and Loft, who, who's come back in, um, who did some damage with last, last year, you know, we'll pay every respect to how they play, um, which they can, they can knock it when they want to knock it, and that was the message from the dugout last year quite a bit, you know, get, get it in behind us, but they can also play as well, so, you know, I think it's, it's hard to call, you know, I don't think they'll just drop off and let us play, uh, I think they'll be um, up for the battle and in front of a big crowd on Saturday for us. Yeah, it's international weekend into international break. You're expecting a good turnout. It's also a local game, I guess, as well. So expecting a lot of fans to come on Saturday. Yeah, I've just been informed actually. I think it's going to be bringing um, was it 900 plus, which is is really exciting to fill that um, away end. And we're hoping that um, you know the town fans are right behind us in their numbers this weekend. I'm sure they will be. Well, best of luck. Cheers. Thank you.